Jason here from Scooter Book Corner, and I am hopping on to film this flip through of my last birthday themed journal that I will have for sale on my Instagram page uh, at Scooter Book Corner, and the sale will be the 31st of August. Uh, I will probably be aiming for somewhere in about the 8 p.m. mark Eastern Standard Time, but make sure that you follow me over on uh, my Instagram page in order to find out all of the sale details. So, uh, let's get started. The cover is made from a no-shed glitter fabric, and it is lined on the inside with a black and white buffalo check. It is stitched on the edge. It's a little harder to see on the cover because it is black, um, but it is there. The front design is vintage Chanel scrap, and then this adorable little birthday applique uh, printed out, so this is fabric. And then I've just added this cute little bow on there to because <laughs> she had a little bow in her hair. Uh, and then just some stitching. So this is a real simple design. Um, just like all of the other journals, the, they are elastic bound. So the signatures are in there by elastic. They are removable. And each page of the signature is also removable. So you can take them in and out, do what you wish uh, with them, and so forth. So the first page of the uh, journal, I actually have added now this... Um, pin holder loop it's a binder clip and so if you have a pin uh, that you want to keep in your journal you just slide it right down in the loop it's really easy this makes it look hard okay so anyway you can slide your your pin in there so all of the journals actually are going to have um have a loop i just hadn't put them in there yet so this is one of the illustrations that i did just with some gelato on i'm sorry my cat is getting ready to crash the party here it is knocking things over oh my gosh okay um so there is this little cupcake illustration that i did on vintage book paper it is in this sewn shaker flap attached by fabric and it flips up and you can uh, add things underneath that hi jiminy coming in to wreck everything okay thanks bud <laughs> On the back side here is just a, a double pocket with some journaling cards tucked in there. Over here I have this balloon uh, animal <laughs> clip. So here is a uh, pocket. This flips open. You can add things here, add things there. Uh, index card. If you've watched any of the other journals, that at this point should be familiar <laughs> because... I made a set for every journal. Uh, on the back side, uh, this little matchbook is in there, and I had it attached. Oh my goodness, Jiminy, how are you turning off the light? Okay, uh, so there's a little pocket up here, and there's just a tag tucked in. So over here, two pockets. So I just have uh, tags in here and just a little die cut. And then just a tag here, topped with a cute little vintage button that I sewed on. That one is tightly fitting. <laughs> uh, a tag here, a little decoration down here in the corner, and then this flips open. All right. So there's, you know, lots of those little journal spots, tuck spots, little details, all those kinds of things throughout the journal. A little happy birthday tag, stitching. This is another, um, so this is actually on a piece of dyed paper. It didn't get fully dyed. <laughs> so uh, just kind of thrown out there with this little mixed media attempt here. This is actually tissue paper. And then I drew this little cake and it's just clipped on here with this um, bow. It looks like, you know, um, like a present. You are more than welcome to take that out, throw it away, use it. But, you know, it's just kind of like an extra little feature. Uh, all right. So inside this bag, just like the other journals, has um, some of the extra little uh, decor pieces, you know, that you can kind of put throughout. There's another little circle that did not come out, but, yeah, right. Okay, 
Uh, so on, there it is. Actually, it did come out. <laughs> I was like, there should be another one. Okay, so this side, uh, mostly decorated, but there's a little spot you could journal here. Then the center here is uh, a bag. Uh, so I've just added, you know, all this little decoration there, vintage pieces, some inking, stamping, a little tuck there, made this large tag. And on the back here, it um, there's a tuck spot here is uh, the back side of this CD sleeve and so obviously you can reach in to get the items out in there there's a right now there's just a yellow doily uh, and a journaling card that's in there <laughs> doily really wants to slide out oh I am filming this first thing in the morning I've just put the last kid on the bus and obviously my brain and my fingers have not caught up <laughs> With all of the tasks on my to-do list. Okay. Um, down there is the, uh, is a, you know, a vintage book page. And I just have these things tucked in there uh, for journaling. Again, just some more paper and places to journal. Um, just a tag. You could tuck a, like a little die cut in there or like a little ticket. I, I don't have one in there, but you could. Uh, just some more decoration. Here is one of the uh, hidden paper clips and a one of the index cards. And then down here, I made this adorable little party hat charm. Uh, so you know you have your own little bar party hat attached with that uh, bulb pen. Over here, I have a fabric pocket and just have some tags and journaling cards tucked in there and that's the other side of the hidden paper clip i have the tim holt strip in here <clears throat> this is just a piece of paper folded in half that you can obviously journal but you know there's our guy with his party hat so on this side i have vellum pocket here and i have a stitched index card and then one of the mixed media tags uh, birthday style and that is the end of the first signature here is the start of the second signature so I have this uh, safety pen that has been beaded with wish a little bit of cray paper trim down here I just have a journaling card here is another tag with the balloon topper and it opens up and then there's additional places to journal again there's stitching here there's yellow stitching um, there's different colors but the yellow just really does not want to show up on camera so cray paper ruffle because you know what's more birthday appropriate <laughs> here's another mixed media um, tag or journaling card and this is a die cut from little pink studio here's a doily okay and then over here just have this fun fringe paper clip and it is holding on a journaling card uh, an index card that has a cupcake liner stitched on it and just another journaling card. Okay, and on the back side of this has a giant double layer tag and it has the iridescent trim tool. So the inventory tag on top of a giant tag, which is perfect for journaling. So over here, fun little balloons decorating this side. Here again is the, um, one of these library cards and just another fun uh, journaling card that's birthday themed okay i have a clear pocket over here and in that i have a journaling card and just a plain manila tag but it's it is decorated with a little bit of trim a bulb pen and then of course that fun little balloon charm over here some more of that cray paper fringe uh just a little bit of decoration there so, uh, envelope that I have decorated and painted up with some fun paint. And then there's an inventory tag, or sorry, a repair tag in there. Index card pocket, just another uh, journaling spot. Over here is a second version of the fabric flip of where I've done some artwork. Uh, so, this is a cake. 
So the, the only thing that I did do in this one that this technically is bound. So you could cut this off if you don't want it in there bound. But um, I just kind of wanted to make a top pocket here. So there's another index card with, you know, a cupcake liner. Here's one of these little pockets that have all these little um, decorations in here. Here's where you could make like a specimen card out of paper it has one of the embossed stickers it says birthday it has little tags um die cuts you know all of that kind of fun stuff down in there and then on this side there's a die cut that tucks in there here's the guest check that's stamped with the birthday girl and um it has the balloon paper clip on top it's a fabric ruffle tuck spot there just another journaling card sticker and then over here this adorable little um, ice cream charm is on the top there that paper clip some more tags and journaling spots and next card <clears throat> and then on this side I just have some additional places that you can journal love these little retro images here so the other side of the map pocket, there is another cupcake liner, some lace, washi that's been stitched, and then this cute little girl. And because the paper is just a little bit older and a little bit brittle, brittle and those clips are very tight, I just kind of tucked over this fold, uh, folded piece to kind of act as a good place to bind. And then this page is just kind of really different. So you can leave this decorated as is you can tuck things up in there i have this manila tag that's currently held up in there but i thought the colors turned out so fun i don't know anyway uh there's the other side of that doily another one of the tags is tucked up here into this tuck spot my cats are are destroying everything behind me okay uh fabric tab some fun uh stamped index cards and here is another tuck spot with another fun index card and then that's the image down on the bottom okay that's the end of that journal let me know what you think make sure you leave me a comment it helps my channel gain um, some exposure and uh, let me know what you thought about this journal and if you haven't subscribed already make sure that you do that if you like what i've shared and until next time have a great day